Hi friends, welcome to Tutors Funny Channel. Today I am going to teach the radio button selection using Python programming. Here there will be the two choices. Here this one should be the courses. Uh, here we have to select uh, this is a radio button group one, group two. We have to select both, right? Here first we have C sharp from this group. Here I am going to uh, select this in second group Python, right? We have a uh, multiple choices courses, right? We have choose, right? So here we click at here C sharp with Python. It's coming, right? If you click C C C plus plus VB dot net, now it this time C C plus plus and VB dot net. Now if you select looking for this Java with Python, right? Here you will be able to select the courses likewise, right? Very simple one. Uh, let's see how to do this system step by step, right? Let's close the one. Now here look at the designing of the form right this is a design right here this is the GUI application we have to import this package after that here this is the things we have to import for GUI application make the GUI application after that we have to write the top this one for the window size right here this is the window size uh, after that we have to create the radio one this is the first uh, int varchar radio sorry radio varchar radio one varchar we have created two variables over here so here first one R1 equal radio button. This is how we have to import the radio button in Python, right? Okay. This is how we have to import the radio Python, right? Now here we have to write like this. Okay. Now here first what I'm going to do is we don't need this one, right? We have to remove the commas and everything, right? Right. Right now, right now here. Now what I'm going to see the radio button. We have created the variable R1. This is a radio button we have tried. This is the text we have to appearing on here. Right, this is a text. Right here, radio. This is a variable radio. This is a text. This is a value we have set it as one. Right, it's a value we have set it as one. Uh, after that, we have the place we have where we our frame it should uh, display. We have to set the set the position over here. That's why x equal 10, y equal 10. This position should be here, right? The say after that we have to radio button this one. Text C C plus plus value two. This is a value two. Position we have to set it here. After that three position set it here, right? The same thing we have to write the another C C plus plus and VB dot net and Python all the stuff we have to set is the same thing likewise. Very simple. You don't worry about that. I have all the source code I have provided in my website tutorsfunny.com. You will be able to download and uh, put into your projects. Right? Very simple. Now here, when the when you select the selection, if you select uh, C++ and Python, click add button. It's it is display over here. How to do the task here is uh, I have declaring the label over here below. It's a label pack. Right? declaring this is the position we have set it here after that when you click the button add button there will be the command right command we have selection we have to give here it goes to the function this one it's take the radio dot get me this is the var variables we have set it here this is a group one we have set it here this is a group two right here there there will be the various two groups right so first group radio one what is the selection you are selected here one or two or three okay that's a value right that value will be assigning to the selection second uh, second uh, radio button group what the value you are selected it is assigned to the selection one group right so here we have to uh, match right if selection is one mean item should be c sharp if the selection is matched with two mean c plus plus if the selection is three mean it it will be java right the same thing here selection one variable this is a group it's meaning of group one right so here this one will be C sharp and VB.net and Python. This one we have selected with the selection will work, right? So after that we have to print those values into the label, right? So label.config text equal item. Label config text equal item one. We have to select it like this. Okay. Item one, item two mean this all the value what you are selected over here. It will be putting to the label one mean this label one text box. Label uh, label text box label one text box mean this one. This is how we have to work the programming well. It's very simple. Uh, you must study this one and you will be able to write the code. 
थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग इफ यू लाइक माई चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब मी लाइक मी थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग